Ever wonder what the real reason is behind your favorite classic stars of the silver and small screens? Real Stars Weekly's got you covered. Joaquin Phoenix, classic star of the 1980s Leave It to Beaver reboot, was born sometime in the mid-70s. His parentage and exact birth dates are unknown. He first materialized as a young boy in rural northwest Spain, where he was found rolling around naked in a field of barley caught in a snare meant for small, parasitic rodents. Although the peasant sharecropper who stumbled upon Joaquin admits that he growled at her menacingly and threatened her with non-existent knives, she maintains that it was nothing personal, only defensive posturing, and once she freed him from the snare, they became fast friends. Luckily for Joaquin, this peasant sharecropper was also a top television executive in Hollywood, by the name of Luz Valencia, and she had a feeling that Joaquin's raw, animalistic sexual energy would be a great fit for the new, Leave It to Beaver reboot her production company was producing. Sometime in the late 1980s after earning critical and commercial acclaim for his role as Kyle Cleaver in the new Leave It to Beaver, Joaquin removed all his clothing and Emmy Awards and disappeared into the Los Angeles National Forest, never to be heard from again. However, to this day, on the anniversary of her chance meeting with Joaquin in the barley fields of rural northwest Spain, Luz Valencia finds dead rodents on the porch of her summer home in Glendora, lovingly arranged to spell out the word, friend. Want to hear more real stories of your favorite classic stars? Subscribe to Real Stars Weekly, and let us know what classic stars you want to hear the real truth about.